Leonardo da Vinci, written and illustrated by Andrew Toffoli. Leonardo da Vinci, an artistic and curious feline, was born during the Renaissance in Vinci, Italy. As a cub, Leonardo was very curious about the world around him. He would explore it for hours. And hours. And hours. Leonardo also loved to draw and paint. Soon word spread all over the land that Leonardo was a great painter. People lined up from far and near to have Leonardo paint a portrait of them or someone dear. Leonardo wanted his work to be grand, so he spent hours and hours painting just one hand. Posing for hours made people complain. Oh, this picture better be perfect. Posing is a pain. Patience, patience, Leonardo would say. Do you want to look like a person or a bale of hay? Not all of his portraits were complete, but one was, and it was an amazing feat. It hangs today in the Louvre in Paris. Her name is Mona Lisa, and some say she is the fairest. His next project would be on a wall, as a group of monks hired Leonardo to paint a mural in their dining hall. The painting was called The Last Supper, and the monks enjoyed gazing at it while eating a feast of turkey, grapes, wine, bread, and butter. Leonardo was an accomplished painter who also loved to invent new things. He was inspired by the world around him. Leonardo dreamed of flying in the air like the birds and bats. So he built a flying machine. Inspired by all of the possibilities, Leonardo set out to create more inventions. He dreamed of swimming like fish in the sea. So he drew plans for a diving suit. He dreamed of floating in the air like a dandelion. So he drew plans for the first parachute. Leonardo was amazed by a horse's strength and speed, but he grew tired of buying all of their feed. So he drew plans for a carriage without a horse that would later be used to build a car, of course. All of this hard work made Leonardo tired and achy. He dreamed of taking a long, hot bath to soothe all of his aches and pains. So he drew plans for a water heater that used the sun for power, which would keep his bath hot for hours and hours. Leonardo locked all of his ideas away in a book so they would not be stolen by some crook. Though most of his sketches remain hidden in his book, after 200 years someone finally took a look. His plans were so grand that many of them inspired the great inventions of today.
Leonardo da Vinci was a Renaissance lion who was truly ahead of his time. He designed and imagined with pleasure and glee. His inventions paved the way to modern technology. The end.